container. If I just touch it there so it's not touching the side, you can see it's floating. I'm not doing anything apart from bringing my magnet close and look what happens. Straight away it is attracted, so I can move it that way. If I take my magnet, it will stop it and it comes back. Now that's pretty powerful. You won't go to do this at home unless you buy a really big magnet like this. This one cost me £11 on AliExpress, but you can buy them if you wait a couple of months. I'll come in the post and you can see, look, it just pulls it around. So it's floating on the, on the surface tension of the water. So force is equal, opposite and balance. But in this direction, I'm creating an acceleration. So that would be Newton's second law, wouldn't it? If I accelerate something, if I cause an unbalance of forces, so I'm creating a force in that direction, it's Newton's second law. Whereas in the up and down directions, you could say it's Newton's first law. So there we go. If you enjoyed that video, please like and subscribe.